All right, so we have some allegations Nile has made against King Cobra JFS. Some of these allegations can be pretty disgusting and you guys will see for yourselves and judge for yourselves. I'm gonna try to go through and just edit them quickly down. Now, this is a black screen for almost the entirety of this. So I will leave the chat up and I'll have some pictures and graphics and funny things throughout the video to keep you a little entertained visually. Um, but yeah, for the most part, listen to what she has to say. It is wild. All of the allegations you're about to hear are not necessarily true. They are just things from now. This is just her saying them and I'm just reporting on them. Just, you know, for entertainment purposes only and all of that jazz. Um, so just FYI, this is now speaking on Thursday night around the hours of 2 a.m. to 4 a.m. So I will be clipping down two hours of the most heinous things that she said in response to Josh breaking up with her. Let's go. And you get banned. You can get banned goodbye to you. Luxicon never said anything, so goodbye to her. Bye-bye, Luxicon. Uh, you door dash just as much as Josh, but you're a catfish. So anyone who meets you in real life will like, wow, that's not... Anyways. Luxicon couldn't answer me, so she got the boot scootin' boogie. Oh, justice for her? Oh. Well, Justice, okay, you must obviously be her 2.0, so goodbye. We don't do justice around here. Unless it's justice for me. We don't do justice. So, if you're supporting that, you're obviously Ariel or some kind of other sicko type socio. And, um... Yeah, she couldn't answer me, so she gets the boot, and you also get the boot for associating with her. So goodbye, good day. What you want to smell your mom's butthole? That's disgusting. Why don't you just and do it? Why do you have to ask her permission? Just do it, and then apologize later. You disgusting. You you, you want to smell your mom's butthole? That's disgusting. Probably smells like five day five days old. Skin so soft, Avon and some like Taco Bell. <laughs> oh, ten thousand. Oh, you were gonna pay me one dollar for your your hardship. Aw. Oh. Keep your dollar, baby doll. You probably need to buy, like, a tortilla to split into four to split with your family. So, I'm not going to take that dollar away from you, baby doll. You need to eat. You need to eat. So, save that dollar for you and your family and your ratchet mama's fucking busted out butthole. Her busted bussy. Bussy, bussy. Instead of sucky sucky, it's bussy bussy. My sucky sucky is out of commission right now. But you can bussy bussy. Bussy bussy. Bussy bussy. Notice how quickly her mood shifts from kind of joking with these trolls in her chat to this right here. Let's go. Um, because I've never once hit Josh. He literally put his hands on me twice. On his birthday, nonetheless. He choked me twice on his birthday, okay? The one time the cops need to actually bust in his door and shit. The, the one time the cops don't show up because Wolf has been cried too many f times. He put his hands... I've never once touched Josh. So he's a delusional piece of shit, if that's what he's saying otherwise. I've never once put my hands on him. And he also lied to me. Oh, I'll never put my hands on you unless you put your hands... No, he put his hands on me first. Okay, thanks. Yeah, he did. After I told him to leave me alone multiple times, he put his hands on me. Thank you. Yeah, he choked me twice on his birthday. Yes, he did. Yep.
all because he got caught jerking off to some chatter bitch because I went to go do another load of his line. And this one I wasn't going to stream. I was just going to start the load. I know how long the load lasts. Started load, came back. He was on Chatterbait Jack, and I was like, really? After you f me for two to three hours, this is what? Okay. You think this woman is going to come out and visit you? No, she ain't. And he wouldn't. he would not answer me why he did that. All day, I just wanted an answer. All day, I wanted an answer. All day, I wanted... And then he was hanging out with Aaron. I was trying to go to sleep in his room. He came back, touching all... I didn't... I wanted him to touch me. Talk to me. He couldn't talk to me. I told him, no, no, no. Don't touch me unless you can talk to me first. Communicate. No, he choked me afterwards twice. Yeah, he did. He did. Yes, he was jumping off to chatter while I did his laundry. Yes, yes, he was. Yes, he was. After we literally fucked for like two to three hours. Yeah, uh, that's not long enough? That's not good enough for you? That's not long enough? Matthew, keep making your comments. You're, you're going to be next on the chopping block here. So <laughs> I'll ban you too. I don't give a fuck. I'll ban all of you. I don't care. Make, make, make your fucking jokes at my fucking expense, please. Thanks. Okay, you want to be banned? Good. Bye. Get out of here. Goodbye. Oh, I don't smell very good. That's a fucking lie. As if he ever took one second to smell me. Um, I use lush shower gels. Yes, the fuck I smell good. Bitch. I literally used to work at Home Depot. And I would make sure I would smell good to get compliments. <laughs> And I don't smell good? Okay. <laughs> well, my little tactic at Home Depot seemed to work because I got compliments all the time about how the fuck good I smelled and what was I wearing, okay? So, yeah. He literally only showers when he has to, like, step out of the house, which is never. So, <laughs> yeah. I never said he smelled bad. I'm just saying he only takes a shower when he has to go somewhere. Otherwise, he will not take a shower. Because he doesn't see the need. I know the fuck I ain't going to say I smelled bad when I literally had uh, shower gels and perfumes. I know. That's why I complimented him, and he never once complimented me. <laughs> but I smell bad? Okay. <laughs> why would I sm say he smells bad, even if he's lying about me? He's a piece of shit. Why would I smell bad? I have all of my teeth. I brush my teeth. I take a shower on a... How do I not... Maybe just because you may not like the smells that I'm wearing doesn't mean I smell bad. Because I'm not dirty, thanks. I'm crying? What am I crying about? I'm talking. Where do you hear crying at? You sound like an abuser. Where, where am I crying? Do you hear crying? Do you, do you hear crying? Because I don't. He wanted to puke because I smell bad? Okay, that's that's actually hilarious. That's actually really hilarious because, you know, when I was wearing my army jacket in that black 
police sweater that I took the badges off of. I don't know what in his place made my sh made me want to puke to where I had to wash my jacket. And and I didn't even do that when I was there. I waited till I got home. But his scent was on my stuff. But there was also a scent of something that made me straight. And that wasn't because of me. So he must be smelling himself because I don't f stink. So he's delusional if that's all he can come. I smell bad? I literally used to catch whiffs myself at Home Depot. I'm like, God damn, who smells? And, and I would realize, it. I'm like, oh, fuck, that's me that smells. Baby doll, I used to get compliments on a daily basis about how good I smelled. I don't smell bad. You must be smelling your own f upper lip at this point. So, so I know the f you ain't saying I smell bad. What did you say? If my pussy smelled bad, you wouldn't eat it? So if I smelled bad and you're such a big man and stuff, you couldn't come out and say, Hey, you smell bad. Can you smell better? Because you have no shame in what you say to me. Did you ever once say I smelled? No, you didn't. So, yeah. I made his bed sheet smell. No, that ain't true. <laughs> I, I, that's why I literally washed his... You know what? The day I did his laundry, the day of the stream where I was in the laundry room and stuff, you know, I had to come back for something, right? And and he saw that his bed sheets and all of his whatever, his blankets, bed sheets, wherever were gone, and his girlfriend was gone. You know, he literally was right in my face, nose to nose to me, eye to eye, screaming at me like a banshee screaming at me because he didn't know where his girlfriend or his bed sheets were so the first day I got yelled at eyeball to eyeball and then the second day doing his laundry I come back and he's jacked to some bitch on chatter yeah. but I smell bad that's why I took a shower on a daily basis over there, and he, I had to force him to take a shower, so I, I don't want to hear that. Yes, he's really a baby. How the fuck do I, so if you're all about communication, which you claim that you're about... You couldn't tell me, hey, babe, you smell a certain way. Oh, really? That's why I took a shower every day there, and you didn't. Let's not go there. I smell bad even though I washed your sheets? No. Again, we're not going there. Um, I had to wash his stuff twice because you don't even know how dirty that water was. I could have showed you on stream when I did the laundry stream. I could have opened it up and showed you how dirty that was. That's why I had to wash this stuff twice. Because it was straight gray. Gray. Gray water. Okay? Gray water. That's why any time I did any of his laundry, I did all of it twice. Yeah. I, I know we're not doing that, that I smell bad. <laughs> when I literally had a plethora of perfumes with me to choose from. I had like three to four perfumes to choose from. I smell bad? No, I don't. I take showers on a regular basis. I don't smell bad. He literally... That was probably the first time I experienced such a... Th uh, was when I did his laundry the day I streamed. And I came back for something and... And he got in my face and screamed at me at the top of his lungs. That he didn't know where his bed sheets and blah blah and all that... And or his girlfriend was. Huh. Cool.
No, it's not his fault that his clothes make the water gray. It has nothing to do with the apartment. That's how dirty his clothes were. I don't know what you're talking about. Obviously, he doesn't appreciate shit, but I smell bad? <laughs> That's funny. I smell bad. No. No, I don't. He doesn't want anyone being nice to him. And you know, he only complimented me earlier because he had an audience, right? Oh, you look hot in that black dress with the colorful. He doesn't talk to me like that on his own. That's why he wanted me to talk to him on his own earlier so he could f cuss my ass out. He wanted to be nastier to me than he was on the public. That's why he's like, oh, I don't want to, if you loved me, you wouldn't be doing this public. No, I'm doing it because, um, you're an abusive piece of shit and I want people to see that. <laughs> if I loved you, no, I did love you. I did. And you've done nothing but call me names and put me down <laughs> ever since I've known you. So, fuck you. I've never once called him a name. I've never once put, and he said earlier, oh, I ignored, oh, I said I was ignored. No, I never, that never came out of my mouth. He said that I called him a piece of shit. I called him an ass. I'm like, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. He said, yes, you did. I'm like, no, I've got 87 people in my chat. I never called you an ass or a, none of this shit. <laughs> but heaven forbid you say anything that he does to you. Okay. <laughs> He is an abusive piece of shit. Yes, he is. He's abusive. Yes, he is. And I smell bad? No, I don't. I, I took a shower. I use my Lush products. I know which smells... Of my Lush products stick to me. I don't smell bad. So maybe you don't like the smell I was wearing. But you never once said that sh me. So what are you? A liar? I know the fuck. I don't smell bad. That's why I literally had some. F only could I smell your tactical soap. And s but I literally also had a stench. As well on my jacket. And, and that probably came from your couch. Because I don't know where else that stench would have come from. Except for that nasty. It's Wait, it's not a couch. It's a chair or whatever it is. I, I don't know where else that stench would. But he must be smelling him own self. Because I know <laughs> he ain't smelling me. Because he was never that intimate with me to get. Smell like me, me, smell me like that. Say, no, the f I don't. I got a plethora of. F I tr I chose different shower gels depending on. Oh well, maybe he will like this one or this one. I don't know. And perfect. No, <laughs> I don't f stink though, bitch. I don't know if it's been peed on, but I wouldn't fuck. I don't know. You know my green army jacket. I was wearing my green army jacket with that black police sweater. And the tips of them had a rank smell. That made me want to puke every Of course, her ad break cuts us off here. But yeah, this is really rich coming from her, isn't it, you guys? Hmm, sound off below. Why is it about making someone jealous? Like, focus on me, your girlfriend at hand. Like, why do you need to make anyone jealous? Um, can you just buy it, please? I don't know what the couch smells like. You act like I put my nose up to it. I don't. I don't know. I'm just telling you that my army jacket and my police sweater. 
minus the tactical soap smell, it also had a smell of stench. And it was not like that before I came. So it was probably his chair because I don't know where the fuck it would come from. So it was probably his chair. I don't fuck smell bad. I literally had people... <laughs> baby dolls. I hate patchouli. I, so I would wear patchouli, right? Just to fuck with the... Oh, I hate patchouli. But they'd come out. Oh, you smell good. And I'm like, <laughs> well, that's funny. Because you said you hated patchouli. That's what I'm wearing. You hate it? Or are you just a part of the end crowd that, like, hates? Because I've heard that my whole... Oh, my God, patchouli, you're a happy hippie. Oh, get away from me, hippie, dippy. I love patchouli, but fuck off. I wish I could have been hanging out with a 60 year old as a five year old child learning which stuff. Fuck you. Who, who are you? You ain't a nobody. I'm not upset. He's fake. What am I upset about? I'm upset that he's not, he claims he's all about communication, yet he blocked me. Gotcha. You're a five-year-old man-child. The only reason he complimented me earlier is because he had an audience. You know, he called me a 10 in front of Aaron, right? Before I knew who Aaron was, he called me a 10. And so when I said that to him, because do I think I'm a 10? No. But hearing my supposed man say that, I thought, yeah, you should feel good about yourself about that. You know how ugly you feel. So for a guy to like, no. Nope. Exactly. He did not let me communicate, and he did interrupt me. Yes, he did. But he'll tell you all day long he didn't. But you guys were there. I had 87 people. for. You saw it. You heard it. Because he thinks he's so smart. He thinks he knows what I'm going to say, and I cannot stand people like that. That, like, okay, I get it. Like, if you see the Instagram things... And it, like, tells you about ADD, autism, whatever. I don't know. But, like, Instagram, for me, shows me shit I need to see. <laughs> That's how my Instagram works. Um... Uh, well, that's why I unmuted it. That's why I unmuted Because when he literally said, I'm glad that you can... He literally said... I'm glad that you can admit that you're a bigger alcoholic than King Cobra. That's what he said. And I said, oh, what? And I get he was trying to also commend me for... See, he says cutting down, but I know. I was trying to... I don't want to cut down. You, you don't understand. And the reason you don't understand is because you don't let me finish. When I drank the other night... That was the smallest bottle. Well, besides the little nipper thingies. <laughs> That's the smallest bottle you can get. And the fact I was that way on that small bottle. Making me feel like, no, I don't need it. If I can feel that way on a the bottle I always drink. And now I feel that way on... At 19, no, I don't need the alcohol. Oh, tell me, no, he freaked out when I told him. I said, oh, yeah, this is what you drank the other day, right? Those voodoo ranger tea thing. I had a peach one. I think one was peach and one was. It's like, no, don't waste that. At least give them to your parent. Why? Why? When I tried to pour that beer out the one time and they called me an alcoholic? Both of them did. Both of my parents. The day I poured that beer out in my kitchen sink, I was called an alcoholic by both of them. 
<laughs> make that make sense. Alcoholics waste alcohol? No, I thought literally alcoholics will take alcohol from anything they can to get the feeling. So, I'm an alcoholic. You don't like me drinking. But if people buy me alcohol, beer, I should drink it anyways. And if I don't drink it, I should give it to you. No. You got the money. If you wanted these Barbies of so many years beyond yonder, you have the money. You can, you can buy that yourself. Um, anyone buys me alcohol, I'll make sure to find those Barbies. I'll buy them, and I'll pour alcohol on top of them, and then I'll light a fire on top of them. How about that? And then maybe you'll get the hint to quit sending me bullshit in the mail. When whatever you send me, I send right back to you. On fire with shit covered on it. You. What doesn't make sense? Okay, that doesn't make sense. That doesn't even make sense. What are we talking about? Uh, I, I can't comprehend with you, so I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, you're calling me an alcohol because the beer was bought for me, not for you. If you want free beer, go deal with your own trolls. If you want free beer, get on your own platform and get your own trolls to send you your own sh If it's in my name, it's in my name. I have every God-given right to do what I want with it. Do I not? Yes, they literally called me an alcoholic for pouring out beer. And then, you know what they did after that? They had, like, bought beer. They bought, like, some Dos Equis and whatever the f I'm like, wow. So I poured out these, like, two or three forties. However many, it, I don't know, at least two. I, I pour out these forties. You have a heart attack. So you buy more alcohol. Okay, well, the alcohol wasn't your money, baby doll. If you bought it for me with my... Okay. And I, then, okay, you paid for it. I'll give it to you. But did you pay for it? No, you didn't. So you do not get to call me an alcoholic when I'm trying to pour beer down. And and my mom wanted the... She, she wanted the fuck, uh, rum, too. I said, no. No, you don't get the rum. No, you don't. You have money to buy your own if you want it that bad. If you want it that bad, you can buy it off of me th for 30 bucks, right? I think that's what Jessica Mesca pays for it with her or debit card. Oh, she thinks she's so slick crossing out her f debit card number when I already have the number, baby doll. You done slipped up. I have your fake phone numbers that you make up every time on the receipts as well. I have your email address as well. You think I don't have the receipts with all of this information on it? Oh, I'm going to cross out my debit card last for number. She's No, I know your number. Thank you. I, I have that written down. So every time you email my friend thinking you're so smart, you, you done f up. So if you think the FBI is not going to research you when I know your last four of your debit card number, baby doll. <laughs> and I have all your email, phone numbers, all, all of that stuff. I have all of that on every f receipt. So keep on. Keep on doing what you got to do. Why are you asking me what happened to his lizard? I don't know him. What happened to it? You people were there before I... I don't know. What happened to it? You're like questioning me like I have the answer. I don't know. Answer me. You know more about it than I do, so you tell me. I don't know. Tell me what you know, because I don't know jack shit.
And I know the f I smell good. That's why I literally put this... Like, people, they claim... Uh, let's talk about patchouli again. People claim they hate patchouli. But I would wear a lot of scents. Whether it was straight patchouli or it was like a mixed scent with patchouli in it. People are like, oh man, you smell so good. I fucking hate patchouli. What are you wearing? And I'm like, patchouli. And they would like... I, I would just stay... I would just say straight patchouli. Just, I would fuck with them, just to see that, oh man, that's patchouli, oh, I, I'm like, oh, so you're one of those people, like, that hates the fucking, the marshmallow, whatever things, y y y you're one of those people, you, you just hate stuff to hate stuff, y you haven't experienced it for yourself, right, okay, gotcha, <laughs> maybe you'll figure it out one day, baby doll, but, <laughs> Anyways, what do you mean, how do I feel? I feel like shit. And he wasn't a first boyfriend of mine. He was a straight abuse, pedo, pedo, uh, Geppetto, whatever, whatever you want to call him. Um, yeah. So, oh, that's what he wore. That's what he wore. And it, that was such a disgusting scent. I'm like. You need to go find some. That shit is straight trash. Straight trash. I don't know what polos. I'm sure that smells better than Jacquard Noir. Oh, fuck that. It literally smells like vomit in a bottle. I don't know what happened to his lizard. I don't. How how can I have an opinion if I don't really know what happened? How am I supposed to understand what happened? Love inclined men or manners? I don't fucking know, but I just, oh, it smelled so good on that dude. I'm not gonna say his name. It smelled so good on him. Yeah, oh, if it was on Josh, <laughs> hello. Like, all I do is think about Josh. That's all. I, and all Josh does is put me down. Oh, if you really loved me. I do love you. You know what? He actually used to say he loved me when he did. He, he's such a piece of shit. You know why? Because I said, I love you. So let me say I love you unless it makes you uncomfortable. If, if you don't feel right with me, then let me know and I'll stop. I said, but don't say I love you just because I do. And that was not a manipulation tactic. That was not, I'm telling him straightforward. Do not say you love me. The, bitch, how much fucking clearer can I get? So then whenever, like, this is the very beginning. He'd say you love me. I would, I would get so happy. But no, he did not love me. Even one time, probably two months ago, he gave me a voice message. He said, I love you. And I said, I said something about it. He goes, yeah, I was drunk. Okay. And that's fine. You can point out when I get blackout drunk. All I, I understand. I will admit I have a problem. I never said I was. But, oh, he gets drunk. He says stuff. And then you you hear. And then you, and you say something. Oh, I never said that. F*** you. Huh. So. Yeah. Oh, how could it be fixed? Oh, he called me a slag the other day. Because I wanted. Because I told him I felt like a bother. Because, like, okay, Saturday. I didn't try calling him until I got home from the Peach Festival. But, doesn't mean I didn't send him pictures from North Carolina at the observation deck. Because I had internet there. Send him pictures there. Come home, call, blah, blah, blah. I'm going on Twitch. Can you support your girlfriend? Blah, nothing, nothing, nothing. Until Sunday uh, 10 something, 10 a.m. his time, 12 something. I'm not mad at you just being ignoring my phone. Okay, well, if you want to ignore your phone all day, okay, but can you tell me? Like, because it's called communication. Can you, can you tell me that? And then, so, literally, because I told him I felt like a bother, because on Monday, right, okay, I called him Saturday. Nothing, all day. So Monday, oh, I think I was supposed to get piercings. 
I don't know what I was supposed to do, but I, I'm so tired of it. it. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. He could be given the world. And he'll still treat you like shit, so. I don't know where to go. I, I need to go to bed. What do you mean, what is he like when he's not there in court? That's what he's like. What do you mean, What? that's why I recorded him? And it wasn't even recording, it's just that I was on live stream on Twitch. It wasn't, oh, I'm recording, no. It was on live stream. I told him I was on live stream. He acted the way he acted. He knew he was on live stream. Because I respect him. And I tell him, hey, I'm on live stream. If you want me to mute it, I'm going to mute it. He knew he was on live stream. You, you don't get to play f dumb. How, why, why do you think he wanted to talk to me earlier in private? You think so? He could talk to me so sweet? So kind? No. And if I would have went to that, I would have been recording him from... I don't know if you get to keep your phone, because it's, it's you know, that, like, Mormon type uh, way. Yeah, so, like... <laughs> Anyways, um, it's fine. He'll be alone. That's why even Aaron wasn't his friend. If I only listen to... The thing is, and I try to tell this to Josh, and I doubt he listens to anything I say. He's such a... Oh, really? When I ask where you are, why you aren't in video, really? You have no... So everything I say to you, 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 you keep your mouth shut because you feel like I'm such a fucking... That you can't agree with anything? Oh, okay. But any other time, you'll call me out. If I want actual communication, you'll call me out and scream it. But, oh... If I'm saying some other stuff, you, you just keep your mouth quiet and don't... Okay. You, you sound very hypocritical there. So you let some stuff pass and some stuff... Okay, no, it doesn't work like that. <laughs> Unless you're, like, literally allergic to those whatever... No, it doesn't work like that. No. Yeah, he cares about himself first. And when he will not get Ellen, because nobody wants him. He used to have beautiful teeth. I didn't watch him then, because I didn't know him. But I did watch a little short video the other day, and he had teeth. I'm like, wow. He looked really good with his teeth. It's it's f sad. But that's not my problem. At the end, of, that's his problem. I have my own teeth problem, and my teeth at least don't look like his. And I have my own teeth. So, no, it is sad. It is fucking sad because I clicked on the video, and it was you know because these people mock him and they treat him like. Sh and he says, "Oh, every girlfriend I had, the girl, the troll." Oh, he told me, oh, if we break up, it's going to be the trolls. So I guess it was the trolls fault, huh, Josh? No, it's because you are a baby. You're literally like in the mentality of a 13 year old, if not younger. And I don't care if you're autistic. I look past that. I thought what you presented yourself as was what I was... And and that's very false. And that was proven by the, the first time I did your laundry. The day I streamed. The day I did the laundry. Yeah, that's when he was in my face screaming at me like that. But it wasn't until the next day. I mean, I don't know what he did on the first day because I was gone for a Because I was live streaming. The second day. I mean, so he could have been just off on chat. I don't know. But the second day, yeah, that stream wasn't that long and I came in the kitchen. Yeah, he's doing what he's... That's disgusting. Go do that in your bedroom or something. Uh... Oh, I'm sure he used to exercise. I told him... 
last time I visited, we, we should go walk from here. He said, no, I can't do it. I'll be out of breath. I was like, okay. Well, you can go catch a cab, and I'll walk home the rest of the way since you can't do that. So, Yeah, he's a good thing he doesn't work out, because if he did, he probably would have literally had... What is he going to do with the dead but call his dad? I killed my girlfriend. <laughs> Actually, I, I wish he did, so that could be the news of this, the year. King Cobra JFS in jail because he, he can't handle his emotions and killed his girlfriend that fuck the one and only person that fucking loves him for who he is deep down inside but <laughs> nah. no I wish he would have actually though I wish he would have so it could be caught and known about and then nobody would like him because he's a murderer it doesn't matter if it's me. He'll he'll kill me. He'll kill anyone he can fucking put his hands on. He literally told me he'd never put his hands on me unless I put my hands on him first. But you know what? Again, I kept telling him no. And that's touching wise, right? No, don't touch me. Don't hug me. Don't. And I literally said physically like three because there was like bones this bones that bones whatever and then like extra i don't know so i didn't know what sticker was what until i read the thing but no i don't know the little vial that had the little star confetti glitters nope i have to put all this oh you know what <gasps> wait what no i'm tripping out huh? i was like oh no i'm laying on the stars like no i'm not and they're just in a new bag and dispersed a little bit better. About my f life. So why he could have openly spoken to me, he could have already spoken to his, like, whatever those, uh, what, what do you call them? Trash one and trash two? <laughs> I mean, all of these men have stuck their dinner at this point. I mean, what do you... Anyways, I, I can't. My thoughts can't be finished. I'm too ADD for this. I'm going to bed. Oh, he stopped all right. He stopped because he got caught. Yeah, he stopped. He stopped. He turned that shit off so fucking quick. Doesn't matter. It's probably safe somewhere on the computer. What do you mean? Was he? Do he was doing it in his chair. Where he sits all the time. We f for two to three hours. I went to go do his laundry. I came back. Because the laundry was so I'm not. And once again, just when it was getting good, we got interrupted by an ad break. My laptop was rendered useless. Um, And I wasn't even allowed to listen to songs over there. I know. I wasn't allowed to light incense. I wasn't allowed to do anything. I know. Why would he be so mad? I don't know. I don't know what his anger problem... I have anger problems too, but not like him, obviously. I've never put my hands around somebody, so... Blushy, the one time I was on his computer, I accidentally... Because I don't like Apple, and I, I don't like how Apple performs I scrolled the wrong way and that's was like oh I didn't want to see that because it was like some live video of some girl on cam I didn't want to see that so I don't know if that was some person he had saved because it must have been saved because you know he doesn't even save his own girlfriend's twitch stream on his so when I asked him if he could watch me no he asked me for my link every time I'm like, well, why, why why can't you just bookmark my stream on your... Why do you have to ask me for it every time? Can you just not bookmark it? That was like two days ago, Blushy, when I was cooking that fucking pizza. And he called me and I answered. 
And I said, I'm on Twitch right now. You you can watch. Well, send me your stream. I'm like, you, you should have it. Well, I might have it in my messages, but I get so many. Okay, I'm not talking about your messages. You have chatter bookmark. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. You got chatter bookmark. So you, you, you literally like don't know how to bookmark Twitch for your girlfriend? That's why you have to ask me for the link every time? Okay. Okay, but you got chatter bookmarks. So you figured that out. But you say, oh, I get so many. I know you get so many messages, but my messages aren't mixed in with the troll messages. My messages are within my phone number. So again, you, you could literally set up a special ringtone for me but you won't but you can put chatter in the bookmarks because i know it's there i've i've literally seen it but you can't put queen cobra jab twitch on your bookmark because that must take up all your internet space for your I guess. I don't know. Yeah, I was at his apartment and I was like using the mouse and I accidentally scrolled some way or what, and, and I, it was some live woman on. I was like, oh, I don't want to see that. So it must be some b's got saved, right? Must be some b's got bookmarked if it's if it's showing up on his stuff or if I'm scrolling. Uh, but he 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 can't. And save my bookmark for Twitch, <laughs> but you can just save the chat. Okay, gotcha. I wonder if he spends money on those sites. He told me no, but you know what? So I don't know who it was on YouTube that suggested that um, he needs to do cameo and I need to do cameo. But he must have been lurking in my chat or something, or either the same person message him or what he told me one time he said i made four thousand dollars in camera i'm like what okay well i was there for like most of that so like what did you spend that money on there's no where did you spend four thousand dollars like huh because you, you have nothing to show for it. Where did you spend $4,000? You, you made $4,000 on Twitch within a short period of time. And most of that time I was there visiting. Where, where did that money go? I feel he has to. I asked him. I said, are you sure you don't send? He said, no. Why would I send money to these slag whores when I can get it for free when someone else pays? Why would I have to pay when someone else is going to pay? That's what he said. Why do I have to pay for these slag whores when someone else is willing to pay and I can still get off? That's what he said. Oh, split his earnings. That's a lie. <laughs> I don't feel good. I need something to drink. Yeah, I feel like shit all of a sudden. Yeah, that's good that I can recognize that before I go to bed. But, of course I'm speaking. I'm not going to I don't care what, how, if he has 100k or what. First and foremost, I was never into you for clout. So the fact that you're going to sit... You really don't trust me and have never trusted me. And f you, I don't trust you. You off to a and you f for two to three hours. You literally don't respect me. You think that woman is going to come out and fly out and see you and suck you off? And oh, no, she ain't, baby doll. No, she ain't. He has more subs than me. Oh my god. Well, first and foremost, I don't even have a YouTube anymore. Who cares? 
What is he going to do? Put his subs on me and attack me like that gas station? Oh, let's talk about his schizophrenia. Let's talk about that where I was trying to get him to go out. I don't know where we're trying. I was just trying to get him out of his house. And it took hours, right? And he's watching an Ozzy Osbourne podcast. And he's like, he had to rewind it like three to four times. I think it was four times. Because he swears that Ozzy Osbourne shouts out King Cobra JFS. And I was like, okay, the first time, yeah, that sounds a little, but you know, I'll listen if you, if you replay it back and okay. He literally played it like four times at the most. And there, there was no shout out to King Cobra JFS from Ozzy Osbourne on his podcast. No, never happened. He's like, oh, I'm so important, like, Ozzy Osbourne shout me out, but yeah. I was like, I'm not going to make a big deal out of it, but yeah, he shout me out. No, that never happened. That never happened. And then, maybe, like, well, because, okay, so today's Friday, so it's literally been a week since I've actually had a real actual... So maybe or two or three weeks ago at this point, okay, I was talking to him on the phone about what, I don't know, doesn't matter. He literally interrupted me and said, you talking shit about me under your breath? He said, like, Jessica called me a whatever, I don't even know what the fuck, I said, excuse me? I said, I'm talking about whatever I'm talking so I'm talking like a regular person about something, but I'm also mumbling shit about you under my breath. Wow, that's a magic trick if I've ever seen one. Like, please show me how I do that. Like, literally out of nowhere. Out of nowhere. Just claiming I'm talking shit about him under my breath to his face when no, the f*** wasn't. He, he needs help. He, he needs help. He said, Oz, that, that would be like me thinking, oh my God, Bjork made eye, maybe she did make eye contact with me, but Bjork ain't inviting me backstage to take vodka shots with her. God damn. I'm like, Bjork, she f winked at me and said, bippity boppity scooby baby. And then, and that was her invite to me in the back room. Eh, no. So I don't want to hear that sh and what happened to Josh saying, if you smell bad, no. Oh, so really? He says I smelled bad, but yet he f me any time. If I smelled so bad, y you couldn't be like, hey. I know you're clean, but I don't like that perfume you're wearing. Can you, like, wash that or... No, nothing. I don't f stink. I mean, I might right now. I might smell like onions, but I'm not having nobody next to me either. He was probably seeing that nasty f chair. Yikes. So she really had a lot to say. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. I look forward to talking with you guys more, and I will keep you up to date as much as possible over the next couple days to let you know all the happenings between Nal and Josh. See you soon.